Welcome back folks to Sword of Aragorn. Let's continue where we left off, old game. I want to load Y game. That's my other game, my personal game. So last time we left off, I believe, we defended our city and we got the Cyclops that was sighted here. I don't remember if we went here for the goblins. I No, we did not. I don't think we went anywhere there. So let's take a look see at our troops. We have our mages level 1. We need to do some uh, we need to do some fighting. Okay, not now, not today. So next one, no city develop. Okay, we already we already yeah. How about we go for mining? It's just 500. It should help us. Okay, a local merchant begs of you. A hideous monster has taken my pretty daughter from me. Please rescue her. You may keep any of the 5,000 gold the terrible beast took from me. Please, great Maximus, you help me. Through his sobs, you find out that the monster is likely in the grove of trees just to the northwest of Alad. Um, I don't know. Feels like um, so much hard work. A lot of simping. I don't really like that. So let's um, let's just hang around. Oh wait, what happened? What 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 what, what, what happened? Okay, I've placed that. Place that. Place that. Captain Dillon, Sergeant Derek, place everybody here. Don't care. Don't care. The first heavy infantry right here. Second light infantry right here. Archers and the Alada watch okay okay yeah, you managed to hit my units how I don't know but you know what I do know I know that I wanna go here and charge yeah goodbye cavalry okay now yeah warning yeah 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 now we have ranged attacks so let's use them Warning, yeah, no. Can we do something else? Yes, we can do another attack. Attack? Yeah. So, the first thing I want to do is just take all of these guys. No, the other watch is not needed. And charge these poor goblin cavalry guys. Okay. We took some damage. We took some damage. We can hand-to-hand -hand combat goblins that's fine okay so one of the mages is why we wow we are dispersed with 67 percent okay hey you do you okay so a lot of watch next okay they are not attacking me which is great all I have to do now is take the bowman here and attack these goblins because why not we can do that also it would be nice if I could just get the rangers do I only have one ranger I need to do another range I need to make another ranger oh I need to make more rangers are you gonna surrender yes all right so in this little oh we got one level of the on the heavy infantry we got one level on the other watch and we lost one archer. Okay. Okay. Sure. Oh! To the southeast. Let's attack them. Southeast. So I'm gonna stay right here. Now we're gonna take Sage Corvos, Bishop Altea, Captain Dillon, Sergeant Derek, Captain Todd, Alata Captain. Sir Pert, I'm gonna find uh, alright, heavy infantry, light infantry, third archers, and the Alada Watch. What I want to do now is actually attack these enemies. Long? Oh, we can get them because we have crossbowmen. So we're gonna just do just that. Alright, ooh, <gasps> look at that, that's so yummy, okay, get this, bam, 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 look at the damage, 44 hit points of damage, 
Oh, keep stacking up, please. Keep stacking up. Keep doing that. It's beautiful. Okay, I don't remember if... Um, Marinia sent a plea of help or something, don't remember. Probably not, we just began. Right. I think we completed, we just sent them packing. Am I right? Yes. Okay, Surgeon Dare gained one spell, Captain Todd gained one spell, one level, and Light Infantry gained another level, and we gained some money. Money is cool. I don't see why you shouldn't do that. Ooh, your scout reports a bed of orcs to the east. You're surprised. To the east? So maybe they were trying to sneak on a ladder. Who knows? Maybe. This could have been uh, troublesome. If they actually managed to to get to the city. I don't know if it's um, in the game code or not, but um, let's assume that it is. A lot of watch goes there. So all entrench, all entrench, all entrench and we can attack someone on the east side. Yeah. We need to be careful of orcs because they some of them have ranged attacks not not much it's just thrown weapons i think you know do not do automatic moves i think it's just these guys and you don't think the guys with the spears can do anything to us other than attack because uh, the way you can equip your troops is it's based on weight so there's a weight limit to what your troops can carry and yeah Okay, I think we can do some shenanigans here. Okay, one, two, three, four, five, and five. Over long? Well, we can throw javelins at these guys. Yeah, my troopers are based on the Roman Empire layout, so very defensive, very orderly. I mean, it's pretty defensive in the sense that we can throw weapons before throwing ourselves to the enemy so let's throw our weapons let's attack right now before we sweep them let's attack them with our mages and you know what I think we can do another round of um, sweeping I think we can do that. Yeah. So next. Okay, so they sent this unit to die. Which is great. So all I have to do now is try to... Okay. Let's use our mage. And now it's time for you to die. Over under five orcs, please. All right, so these guys are completely in disarray. Invalid movement. Oh, we have to resupply. Resupply. Get some more uh, arrows. These orcs are quite resilient, I'd say. But yeah, they're they're running away now. Sage Corvus gains one spell, we won the battle, which is great, and now we are going back to the city. So this is kind of the random fights that you have to do in order to grow your troops. Um, do I want commerce to grow? I don't know how much it will grow. I don't know. I think I'm gonna need to hire more troops. Um, I'm gonna go with more mages because yes, it's gonna call I'm gonna call him Sage Xares. I'm gonna hire another priest. I'm gonna call her Bishop Bishop Alan. That's eh, fine. And maybe another ranger. Yeah. 
I gotta call him Sergeant Sarge um Sergeant Fiona. Welcome to the team. Okay, we need to reinforce our units, okay. So infantry, light infantry. The bowman needs one man. The problem is that now a lot of watch doesn't have the men. We need to wait. So city taxation is there. Okay, next. The rumor about a young boy disappearing from a caravan is true. Your captain reports that the merchant and several reliable witnesses have reported the abduction by goblins on the road between Marinia and Brocada. The merchant is offering a reward for his safe return of 6,000 gold pieces. Haha. Uh -huh. Where in August we can try and go look for that boy. We could go, yeah, sure. I I don't know if that's a good idea, but we can try. Agriculture, yes. Alright. So let's take everything we have. Well almost everything. So one, two, three, four, five, six, not the captain. Sir Pert. Do I want Sir Pert with me? Um sure I guess mm, yeah. Um heavy infantry, light infantry. I want the bowmen and the mages. Since we're in August, I think it's best to do it now than wait until it's too late. Your scouts report that a group of goblins has come just to the north. They have some merchant goods and wagons in their camp. Let's attack. The problem is that I don't think the prisoners are still alive. Because these are goblins. Remember, goblins eat humans. Somehow. I think. Okay, Sir Pert is gonna stay right here behind us. Heavy infantry, light infantry, and archers. Also, Sage Xares and Bishop Alan goes there. Sergeant Fiona goes there. And that's about it. Okay, I think someone is gonna try and sneak up on us. Okay, so we have some cavalry. Okay, cavalry is over there. I doubt we can reach these guys over long, so let's move through the mountains. By the way, you can check out the hex. Okay, we have elevation 7, elevation 7, elevation 3, elevation 3. So I think we can reach them. Line of fire blocked. What? The actual crap. Okay, can we do that like that? Yes, we can. Which is great because now I'm gonna move my troops. Like so. Alright. The AI is doing something, I guess. Oh, look at... Oh, if only I could hit that. Can I? No line of fire block. Damn it. Um, can I do it now? Oh, yes. Oh, oh, oh. 34 hit points. Oh, we cannot attack anymore. Right. So, let's just wait. We have Remember, that we have the power of ranged attacks. So, if the enemy is not coming to us, I'm just going to not charge too much because these guys have ranged attacks and right now our infantry is not very defensive when it comes to that in fact if you look at that we have just minus one actually we have minus one armor class from missile attacks on the heavy infantry and zero on the other guys so there's that Line of fire blocked, it's fine. Okay, so the, uh, the enemy doesn't surrender yet. He will surrender though, eventually. Just throw some missile weapons at the enemy. Okay, if we can take out the cavalry over there, the goblin. Ooh. Who's, ooh, who's that? Who's that? 
Literally, who's that? Okay, that should trigger the retreat. Yes. So I'm gonna accept their defeat. Maximus gained one level. Bishop Altia gains one level, one spell. That's important. And we've captured the thousand gold pieces. You have defeated the goblins. Although some goods and wagons were recovered, only a large pile of charred bones remains for of any captives. Oh, that's bad. So the merchant will not like that. In fact, they didn't even pay us anything. So, okay, you need train the Alada watch. Thank you very much. Yes. The merchant has increased the rewards for his ne nephew to 8,000 gold. This has caused more than a few hardy adventurers to journey into the northwest area looking for the boy. Oh, a young man named Olaf has been convicted of murder as and sentenced to be executed. Although no nobody has was found, there were two witnesses who said they Olaf robbed the man. They said they saw Olaf rob the man, hit him over the head, and toss him into the river. So you saw this guy, there are two people that saw this guy rob the man and hit him over the head and toss him into the river and they didn't do anything? What? A large number of citizens have si signed a petition. We beseech thee, Maximus, to pardon the young Olaf who is to be executed soon. Despite the evidence produ produced in his trial, Olaf will never kill anyone. He is ever so kind and courteous. The petition continues to some length and is signed by 86 people, including several wealthy and prominent citizens. Oh, well, um, I'm guessing on a pardon. The young man Olaf is very grateful to you for freeing him. He still wears where well his innocence, which is great. Means he's really innocent. Alada said you donated gold piece to help with the cost of keeping a garrison. What uncommon generosity. No, thank you. Okay, can we move? Okay, we have attrition of 0%, so we can definitely move. Okay, we can still not reach Alada in time. Okay, we can... Uh, okay, let's do com. Commerce seems cheap this time of the year, so I might actually go with some commerce. Right, so we have 5 recruits, still not enough. You need train the Alada watch, yes. Yes. The case of Olaf has been resolved, with the return of the victim to Alada, alive and well. He says that he was knocked on the head, losing his memory of his home for the past month. He says he was attacked and robbed by one of those who spoke in witness against Olaf. Yeah, that smelled fishy. So, are we October? Okay, we can go. Oh, we have to go to the groove. Okay, let's go to the groove. Scott reports that a terrible monster is camped among the trees to the north. You have found a minotaur. None of your men will advance. They fear for their lives. Your heroes are not afraid though. Chor Draximus. Yeah, let's put everybody in a single stack. What could possibly go wrong? Okay, let's go. Charge. Okay, well, almost, almost. Do we still have moves? No. Oh, you t oh, no, you're not gonna run away like that. You're just going to die. And there we go. Captain Nino gains one level, Captain Todd gains one level, and Sir Pert gains one level. Man, the mages are just... You have won the battle, you capture a treasure of 7.5k gold pieces. You have defeated the Minotaur, many among your people want to join your victorious army. Loyalty shoots upwards in Alada. So, um, where are the 8000? No, he didn't give me the money. Oh wait, I guess it was the 7.5k. I guess the other 500 was tax paying. Okay, so you need to reinforce a lot of watch. We need eight people. So now we have a lot of um, a lot of money. 
what we could be doing is conscripting. Um, what can we conscript? We can conscript 60 people, to be honest. Yes. And we can actually conscript another 40. Yes. Alright, now I want to lower the tax to 20%. So the morale should be uh, going upwards. And now what I want to do is you need to make more infantry. Um, 30 people. Alright. And I'm gonna call them Fort Heavy Infantry. Okay, it's gonna go with a uh, chain, large, uh, sword, and a javelin. Yes, then I'm gonna make more infantry. I think it's 30. Yes, I'm gonna go with the fifth light infantry. Okay, it's gonna have chain, small sword, and a what was that? Thrown weapons, or maybe sling. I think it was sling. Yes, let's let's check it out for a second. Okay, we have uh, what is the light infantry? More light infantry has chain, small she chain, small sword, and sling. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I have a sling on that one. You need make bowmen. We're gonna make 30 bowmen. Yes, we're gonna call them the sixth archers. They're gonna go with chain, they're gonna go with small, they're gonna go with mace, and an expo to boot. Mostly because of the range. Now we do have more recruits. And also a lot of money, which means I'm gonna go unit make cavalry. I want to make cavalry or maybe mounted infantry. Uh, no, let's make cavalry. Twenty-five units of cavalry. Yes, uh, we're gonna call it the seventh knights, and we're gonna give them the best equipment we can. Because these guys movement chain okay it's it's something something to start with so we now need to train these guys we need to train everybody to be honest the fourth heavy infantry the fifth heavy something I don't know I'm training randomly train these guys train already done we done that I think we've trained everybody here oh boy more orcs what do you know we need to move these guys so let's try to go as far as possible Yeah, um, I think I'm gonna put the heavy, the light infantry here with the bowmen. There is a reason for that, to be honest. We need to, we need to move these guys here and attack this cavalry. Excellent. I also think it's time to do a little bit of a charge. Okay. So we kind of lost someone, right? Maybe, maybe not, who knows. Right now though, there are a lot of goblins here, so I'd like to, uh, what is that, light infantry? Go there. We're gonna use our bowman here, because why not? 
it's best to use ranged attacks against these guys. See, the problem is if I send my troops in and I have to reinforce them because someone dies, they lose experience, so they may go down in levels, which is not great, to be honest. So why would you want to do that? Yeah, they surrender, they give up. One level, we got the battle, we can go back to our trusty city, where we can use our money to train our troops even more. No, 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 train. Heavy infantry, yes, train. Light infantry, yes, train. The archers, oh, they're only level one. Train, oh, I said train. Train these guys, please. Thank you. Now we have 5,000 gold pieces, okay? Can we develop our city? We can develop fortifications. Those should come in handy. Let's go and develop everything. Okay, let's bring everything to the max. Mining, yes. And now we should be fine. The Tranavan elves have sent an ambassador to your realm. He would like to see the, that relations between men and elf are not hostile. He asks that you reduce lumber development as a show of good faith. Ah, uh, sure, let's reduce. Uh, the reason is, well, you see, lumber doesn't generate a lot of tax returns, so it's fine, I guess. Also, morale is picking up. Growth is picking up because I've lowered tax. I don't need that much money. We barely make enough. And keep in mind, we are in November, so agriculture, you know, all these things suffer a little bit. So yeah, let's save. And yeah, that's all I have to show you for today, guys. Thank you. Thank you for watching. See you next time. Bye-bye.